Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a first impression on this neem and aloe vera face pack and that's the reason I'm looking so glamorous and um, if there is some background noise I highly apologize I am wearing my mic and it's still very noisy it's uh, more noisy than usual and I hope all those uh, sounds are not getting translated onto the video except my voice so let's get started so today's video like I said is going to be a first impression on this Patanjali face mask. This is the Patanjali face pack neem aloe vera with cucumber face pack. This is for uh, to clear clog pores, cools, soothes and softens skin. So the claims are um, a unique blend of pure herbs for clear glowing skin. A uh, neem full of antibacterial properties regulates excess oil secretion, clear clogged pores, skin impurities impart natural glow to your face. Cucumber is a natural toner with a hydrating and cooling properties. And then um, Panka which is actually called Fuller Earth removes deep impurities, cools and soothes the skin. Aloe vera possesses skin softening, healing and maintaining natural moisture balance. So that's what it says, it's not like a claim or something and the method to use apply on a wet face, massage gently, let it dry to, for 10 to 15 minutes and then wash with water. In case it comes in contact with eyes then rinse immediately and this is for all skin types. Uh, the main ingredients are aqua, pack base, methyl paraben, propyl paraben and sugandit divya qs well i don't know what that means and this comes with 60 grams of product for 60 rupees and um, it lasts for 18 months now it does have parabens in it uh, but what i have learned is that um, the ingredient list even if it does contain paraben it doesn't mean that your whole product has parabens like the order in which the ingredients are written is the amount that it constitutes to like the first ingredient is the most uh, ingredient most used ingredient and the second ingredient is second most ingredient and if it is in the last two or three lines then it means that they are used in very small quantities so in this case the parabens are the last um, but second ingredient so actually parabens uh, in small quantities they are actually used to make your product last longer that's the reason why they use parabens in so many products so it just says apply to wet skin of course my skin is not wet i need to apply to wet skin and then just use this face pack uh, leave it for 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse it off that's pretty much what it says you don't need to mix it with water apple cider vinegar rose water or anything of that sort which i like so first off dropped it let's smell it It smells like something I know um, it doesn't have like a chemical smell but then again it doesn't even have a natural smell I just got some on my hand and it looks really watery let me shake it up let's see the texture of this first this is what the texture looks like it's just like a mousse consistency and it does have some granules in it like I am rubbing it in and it has very small like extremely small granules in it it smells like some soap I think it smells like hammam or some synthol or some neem soap I have used this soap once before that's what this smells like so I'm just going to wet my face and then apply this face mask and let's get started and I have dampened my um, face mirror is blinding okay so I have dampened my face it doesn't look like anything but I have dampened my face and I'm just going to apply this uh, face pack like I would with any other face pack I'm going to dot this all over my face and I have this Vega face pack brush and I'm going to apply it obviously has a very 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 nice fragrance I like the fragrance it's kind of like it has a um, neem smell to it I look so crazy on camera hmm. the things that we do for YouTube so on a different note I'm almost done watching power uh, I have just one episode left and I feel like I don't have 
a life after the show is over is it just me i feel so lost when i get caught up with the tv series and then you know like i have to wait every epi- every week for a new episode like just release the whole season together already right so we need some more so you do require a decent amount oh my god there's so much noise in my area it's like crazy and it's the weekend so it's crazy like i was saying i have one episode left and it airs on sunday the next episode and i don't want to watch the one episode that i have left because if i do then i'll have nothing to watch but if i wait until monday then i'll have two episodes to watch but then i have to wait for a week after for the next episode which i'm not about that life that's how i would apply my face mask don't i look pretty so that's about it i mean i feel like it's a little patchy on this cheek let's who <laughs> i look so funny but i feel like it's cooling um it does have cucumber so it does feel slightly cooling but then again it happens with any face mask when your mask is wet uh, it claims to remove clog pores cool soothes and softens the skin um i do feel it cooling and let's see if it uh, removes clogged pores or not and let's see if it soothes the skin so it's currently 7:42 pm and it says to leave it for 10 15 minutes which i am going to let it sit until it's completely dry so that the full effect of the mask happens on my face so we're going to let it sit i will see in 15 minutes if it is you know completely dry or if i have to wait for a longer time so yeah it's now 7:43 and i'll come back once the mask is dry and then let's see where we go from there okay so it's just been exactly 10 minutes and this is completely dry i can barely move my face so i'll just remove all this i have a towel here i'm going to damp it dampen it and remove it and then i'll talk to you Okay so my face mask is completely off. I didn't wash my face. I just used a damp towel to get everything off my face. It did come off fairly easily. I feel a little firm. I don't know. I feel firm after every face mask and I feel like I have pores around this area. Like if you use the magnifying side of your mirror of my mirror then I am able to see it very clearly. But I feel like I feel like my pore size have reduced or they've closed up more. Is that possible? Like I'm looking at the magnifying side and the pores look much smaller than they did way before. Hmm. And my skin feels really good. It feels slightly dry which it does after every face mask. It does feel slightly drying, so I always make sure to apply aloe vera gel afterwards. But Yeah, I like it. I felt like this part, you know, is firmed and this part is firm. And I like the way this made my skin feel. Every mask, you know, it'll make you feel good. Like you have to use it consistently, but for first impression, I feel like my skin is super soft and the pores in this area never reduced. Or maybe they've closed up, I don't know, but the pores look much smaller. then they usually look which is so weird so i like it thus far for first impression i will be using this it does feel slightly drying yeah it does feel slightly drying so i will be topping this face off with aloe vera gel after i finish filming but so far i really like the effect that this gives first impression i really like it so let's see how this keeps going and let's see if this makes onto my patanjali holy grail list So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I feel a lot firm here. Is that weird? I feel firm, or is it just dry? I'm not sure. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give this video a thumbs up and let me know down below if you have tried this face mask or if you have any recommendation for future face masks from Patanjali or any other brand that you would like me to try. Let me know in the comments down below. Please like, share, comment, subscribe and all the jazz and I will see you in my next one. Till then, bye.